Hello, your tech admin here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to install Minecraft in Ubuntu 12.04. Now, the first step to doing this is um, to install a couple of applications from the software center. Um, the first one is called Main Menu, and it is a main menu editor, which for some reason is no longer included with Ubuntu by default. So, we're going to have to install that, type your password. And while that's installing, we'll go ahead and install the other one, and it is Java. Now, um, Sun Java or Oracle Java, I guess it is now, is no longer available under um, Linux officially. So you have to install the OpenJDK, which works fine with Minecraft. I've been using it ever since about I don't know November last year, and I've never had a problem with it. So go ahead and install that as well. Um, you're going to want Java 6, not Java 7. Java 7 seems to cause some problems. I uh, haven't quite gotten that one to work yet. And done. So once you're done installing, um, go ahead and close the software center. And the next thing we're going to want to do is download Minecraft. Um, this is easy. Just go to Minecraft.net, download. And um, under Minecraft for Linux slash other, click this link here. And save file. Next, we're also going to want to download a an icon. Now, there's plenty of icons. You can do a Google search like I showed you how in my last video. You know, there's plenty of icons out there. But um, here are some really neat icons that I've been using here lately. Um, they're the Beautycraft icons. Um, I'm just going to use the default one for this tutorial, but I usually use the uh, diamond ore block. Anyway, make sure you select PNG. Save file. Okay. And we are now done with Firefox. Close that. Next thing, we're going to want to go to our downloads folder here. And we're going to see Minecraft.jar that we downloaded. We're going to right click that. We're going to go to properties. First, we're going to go to this permissions tab. We're going to go allow executing file as program. Next, we're going to go to the open with tab, and by default, it's going to be on archive manager like this. When you open it, you should see it like this. What you're going to want to do is select Open JDK Java 6 and hit set as default, and it'll jump up there under the default icon heading. Once you've done that, you can go ahead and close it. After that, just double click the jar file. And after a couple seconds, Minecraft should launch. Go ahead and log in. And log in. Once you log in, you'll see it starts downloading everything that Minecraft needs to run. Um, that's why we're launching Minecraft right now, is just to get those files done. And once it opens up, you can go ahead and quit game. And next, we're going to go to our home folder, but first, we're going to copy these two files. Just go ahead and do that, and then head over to your home folder. From here, you're going to hold down the control key and then tap H. This will um, show all the hidden folders in this directory. I'm going to scroll down to um, a new .minecraft folder that um, Minecraft should have created when it when we launched it. I'm going to open that, paste in these files. I'm going to rename this one minecraft.png for simplicity. There we go. That's all we have to do with those files. Next, we're going to go ahead and open up that main menu editor we installed earlier. And here it is. We're going to go under the games heading. We're going to add new item. I'm going to name it Minecraft. Um, the command is dash x m x one o two four capital m dash x m s one o two four capital m space dash jar and forward slash home forward slash your username whatever username you use to log in and then slash dot minecraft slash minecraft 
dot jar. That's what needs to be typed in. I'll paste that below the video. Of course, um, you're going to want to replace my username with your username that you use to log in. Um, up here for the icon, we're going to click this. It's going to open up a um, window so we can choose a new icon. We're going to go to the home folder again and back to dot Minecraft. And there's our Minecraft.png that we put in there. It's going to open that. There you go. Add a comment. Not necessary, but I do it anyway. And you'll see your new entry up here right here. Now, something I like to do after I enter this is go ahead and press this move up button until Minecraft is above mines. Because if you don't, every time you hit the um, meta key to open the dash and type in mine, mines is usually going to show up first unless you move it up. And that's kind of annoying because I like to just hit meta key, type mine, and then tap enter. But um, yeah, so you just move that up and that'll solve that problem. And now all we have to do is add it to the um, the launcher over here. So to do this, we're going to search for it. Just click and drag it over like any other icon or any other application. And then we can launch it. Now let's see if it works. Give it a couple seconds to launch for the first time. I technical difficulties. Okay, so I had a little trouble getting Minecraft to launch there, and um, what it was is I realized that I forgot to type Java in front of um, the rest of the stuff in the command line. It was a simple little mistake, but it tripped me up for a second. And um, but you won't have to worry about that. I'm just gonna paste this whole bit of code into the uh, description of the video, and um. Yeah, just the only thing you got to worry about is make sure you replace um, my name, my username, with your username, and it should work just fine. So now I'm going to launch Minecraft, and it should work. Yes, there we go. Well, again. And for the heck of it, I'm going to connect to my server. And here we can see it is in fact working. So that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope this helped. And um, if you have any questions, leave a comment. And I'll get back to you as soon as I can. And you can expect more videos soon. I know I haven't been uploading videos here for about five or so months. But uh, hopefully I'm going to get get back into uh, uploading them and uh, get you guys some new content out there because I, I see that I'm constantly getting new subscribers but I'm not I'm not putting out any new content and it kind of makes me feel bad so I'm going to start putting out content again and um, until next time guys